Turn the lights flash Can you hear the crowd roar? They're calling your name They're feeling your game Is your song ready? Words, vocals, everything. Mm. You are sure? Is your song ready? You know there will be no sheets today. You know. You know there will be no sheets at all. Yes? Yes, sir. Take group songs first. Is that, did you hear me say put the books down? Did you hear that part? Put it down! Winner, step forward. Mirabel, step forward. <laughs> Ellie, step forward. Oluchi, forward. Step forward. Perry, join me. One, two, three, and... Photocopy, cozy. You can never be like me. This is my identity. Ten in the ten, it's a kiss at a tongue. I like when I do this part. Abara, do I do kumbale? No, you can skip that and just continue. Akbalara igunpani. Akbalara igunpani ekon. Akbalara igunpani ekon. Go. Akbalara igunpani ekon. No, who call me? Again! Can I hear one more time? You want to hear it from me one more time? Akbalara, I go pani yoko. Akbalara, I go pani yoko. No, I go pani yoko. You? Akbalara, I go pani yoko. Niye, iye. I go pani yoko. Niye ko. I go pani yoko. I go pani yoko. Forget it. You are all going to be broken your teeth very soon. Bro, you know what's happening? We don't have teeth anymore. Continue. There's no point. What is that? One, two, three, and... Photocopy, cozy. You can never be like me. This is my identity. Teni ni teni taki sa tato. Akpalara igupani yeko. Abara. Adiku bale. Alako meji. Bale rilakata. Everybody, let's go. Photocopy, cozy. You can never be like me. This is my identity. Teni teni taki sa tato. Akpalara igupani yeko. Abara. I swear you to fight. Anytime you there for the club, they want you. All the girls, them, I want to die. All the girls, them I want to marry But not only you, I go make my wife see And they pray and they cast on my day For anything, we go make us fight I don't go lie, it's a man of my day You be the best quality of wife, bro Because everything, and everything I do When I want to enjoy
Mali, me jado. I just came to party. A great all I was. They really low I show. I just wanna answer. Hey, me now all the girls, boys, I want to hold on to. Get scared, oh, go scared. Oh, go scared, scared, oh, go. Get scared, oh, go scared. Oh, go scared, scared, oh, go. Get scared, oh, go scared. Oh, go scared, scared, oh, go. Get scared, oh, go scared. Oh, go scared, scared, oh, go. Get scared, oh, go scared. Oh, go scared, scared, oh, go. Get scared, oh, go scared. Oh, go scared, scared, oh, go. Get scared, oh, go scared. Oh, go scared, scared, oh, go. Get scared, oh, go scared. That's all I want to hear. Thank you. Being back on, um, in the academy after three long years, it felt amazing. Like, like there was so much rushing into my head because it was it was like it was like experiencing everything all over again. Uh, of course, the academy changed. It didn't look like it looked three years ago, but 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 I, I still felt like I was back back in, back three years ago. My name is John Vincent Iwodaro, and um, I was on Project Fame in 2013, season six. Um, the same season as Olawale, Niniola, oh. um, Immaculate, a couple of other great guys. Of course, I'm here with my friend as usual. Yeah. His name's Godwin. Godwin He's an amazing guitarist. Yes. Oh, you know. Yes. <laughs> of course. <laughs> um, on Instagram, is a very popular on Instagram. On Instagram, it's very popular, right? Yes. He's all over the place, like. Everywhere. Everywhere. Um, so, yeah, it's great to meet you guys again. Once upon a time, I was um, where you are right now. Um, in the same academy, um, went through the same kind of things you guys are going through right now. So, and then I've gone into the outside world and <clears throat> I know what it's like. Um, so I've come to share my experience and everything with you guys. The academy, um, it, the purpose generally is to groom you and train you to be better musicians. Um, before I auditioned, I wasn't really much of a musician as such. I was doing music like everybody else, but I wasn't taking music seriously. But I was just doing it in my bedroom because I'm also a music producer and songwriter as well. Um, so, so I was just doing all that stuff in the bedroom. But I knew, hey, I had to get people to hear my voice. People had to know that I could sing or that I was good at, at music and all. So, um, so that was why I auditioned. That was in 2013. And then I got in and um, everything changed. My life was going to change forever. And um, so it's been a great ride so far. Um, the thing is, with Project Fame, with the Academy, there's so many professionals that handle your career. Like, they are like the, the, the height of experienced um, people that can groom you to become who you would eventually turn out to be. Um, you, haven't, you don't know what direction you're going to be headed musically at this point. You may not know. But it's their job to help you find that out. Picture the music industry as a room like this that is stuffed with people. So many people. Especially the Afropop um, genre. So there's so many people. There's so many people in that one room. And you are just one of those thousands of people trying to get into that same room. Which means if you have to get into that room, you need to kick somebody out. And when you kick somebody out, you have to shut the door. But it can also be a lot more easier and more effective if you can create your own room. For example, myself, I've, the truth is I've tried my hands at so many genres of music from, trust me, I've done hip hop, I've tried to rap, I've done um, R&B, straight up R&B, rock music. Uh, no, I didn't do high life. <laughs> uh, I did so many things, but nothing was working. 
until I figured it out. What if I did something that Nigerians are not used to? Like something that's almost alien to them. And like bring it back home. Make it African in some way. Put in pidgin English. Put in local expressions. I know go bounce your call. Stuff like just add stuff like stuff that Nigerians, that Africans, that West Africans, Ghanaians can relate with and see how it turns out. Of course I tried it. It worked. I mean, if it didn't work, I won't be here. <laughs> um, so yeah, so the point is you, 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 you may need, you will need to create something for yourself. Don't just be satisfied with the status quo or with the whole cliche, hey, hip hop music, rock music, R&B. Like it has to be you, it has to have you in the song. I'll tell you one truth. I was on season six, 2013. We were 16 that got into the academy. I think I was like top 12, top 11. I didn't get to win. What does that mean? I didn't make top 10, but I was still able to push. The truth is, even if you get to win, <clears throat> even, even if you get to win this competition, or you get to top six, top, top three, or where, wherever, you still, you still have so much work to do. Like, there's so much hard work you still need to put in. What Project Fame did for me, personally, was to take me from this level and put me here. But then I still had a lot more work I had to do to get myself from here to another level. So for everybody, for every one of us, we, we, we all need to be able to do that. You need to be able to sustain whatever you leave here with. I mean, you came here, you got here. Even if you left at the opening gala show, I mean, the fact that you were on TV and people got to see you, people remember your face, they remember your name. What can you do with all that? So it wouldn't make any sense if you just let all that just like float away or fly away or whatever. I think three years ago, I didn't really see this happening, like coming, coming to be in that chair, like have to be the one to talk to contestants. I mean, we're in the academy all the time and people were coming, we had visitors, we had, I think back then we had Whiskid, we had um, Tiwa Savage, we had KC, Inyanya, uh, amazing people come. Um, I, I don't really see myself in that position anytime soon or if, if it was ever going to happen. But um, for this fame, you never can tell anything is possible. I mean, three years down and I'm back, back to talk to the contestants. Can you imagine? <laughs> it feels amazing. So, um, so I'll let you guys talk, um, just in case you have any questions concerning your, um, your journey so far in the, the academy. Okay. What was the perception? I, I'm sure when, when, you, when you came up with just your type of music, how did you, how were you able to manage the fact that you placed your mind straight, okay, this is what I'm going to do, I'm going to do it. And what's, what's, what's the response you, been, mm -hmm. you, you got from people? Well, initially, not, I, I, I may not have had so much faith in it. Mm -hmm. I mean, it wouldn't hurt to try out something new or take mm -hmm. a risk or whatever. Um, when the first song I did, the first ever, uh, I'm a folk artist, I make folk music. The mm -hmm. first, my first attempt at folk music was a song called Love Don't Like. Initially, I didn't think it was going to work, but immediately I dropped that song. Trust me, the reception was something else. Um, I, got, I was getting calls from everywhere. I was getting text messages, I was getting tweets. Um, by the grace of God, I've been privileged to work with, um, to meet and work with quite a number of um, amazing musicians. I've been able to work with Chilima from season three. I've worked with um, Waje, worked with Vector, worked with Ruby. How many of you guys know Ruby? Yeah, Ruby. No, Ruby. Yeah, Ruby Giang, of course. I've worked with, uh, of course, I've worked with Godwin. <laughs> and, um, yes, I have worked with MI. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, three years ago, was four years ago, I dreamt these with stuff that I dreamt of. And it was amazing that they were all coming to reality. So for you guys, you guys are already stars, take it or leave it. You, you have no idea because you're still here and you don't know what's out, happening in the outside world. And it was like that for us too. You have no idea, but I'm not going to let out too much. I'm just going to let you do your thing. How did you transform um, the journey drill of that time to this person. How change. did you embrace it? What made you, what was that spark? What gave you that spark to change and exactly. uh, like, 
How did it happen? That's all. Let me tell you, let me tell you something I've almost never told anybody. Um, the, the night I was evicted, I, I, got, I got to the hotel room, and then initially when I got out, I wasn't exactly sad. I was sort of, um, it was, I was just somewhere in between. But when I got to the hotel room, it sort of just dawned on me, like, even someone just pours water on you and then you just wake up. Oh my, I've left the academy. Like, I'm going back to my old life and stuff. Um, but I still remember so much that night that I told myself that I wasn't going to let people think this is the end of Johnny Drew. Like, I knew it was going to take a while, but however, how, no matter how long it took, I had to still get people to see Johnny Drew. Um, for me, I knew it was going to take a lot of hard work. I, had, I needed two years to do all that. It may not take you that long, it may take you longer. But bottom line is you still need, you, 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 you gotta be ready to work hard. Like you need to be ready to push. Because yes, you live here, you're already stars, but don't let, the thing about fame is that if you just leave it, it can just float away, it just like vanishes after a while. So you need to be able to sustain that. Any, any other questions? Yeah. So no other questions, right? Yes. Yeah. Oh, All right. Love. A beautiful love. Beautiful love. Yeah. I think the highlight was when I had to sing about sing sing for them. Um, yeah. And the funny thing is, they all they always sing in my songs, like they knew it already, <laughs> like they've heard it, or that it was even them that wrote the song. So yeah, it it really does feel amazing. Um, and and yeah, I'm grateful for that. Oh my beautiful love This song now you are singing I can't explain what I'm feeling but It's real Oh dear My beautiful love Oh my beautiful love I beg you do make it go I know say come on you come out, but it feels like forever. Oh dear. Oh, my, God. <laughs> my darling, you make my dreams come true. And I will do anything for you. They say that I'm a fool. Well, that's fine, because I'm a fool for you. My darling, you make my dreams come true. And I will do anything for you. You guys know my song when I'm here. They say that I'm a fool. Well, I will gladly be a fool for you. See, oh my beautiful love. You are my angel from above. God bless the day that I found you. You're the best thing that happened to me. My beautiful love. Oh, oh my beautiful love. Oh, yeah, I'll make you dance with me, small. Hold my hand, make I hold yours, make you no worry, no go fall. Oh, dear. My beautiful love. My darling, you make my dreams come true And I will do anything for you They say that I'm a fool Well, that's fine, cause I'm a fool for you To get all the funny videos, live performances, academy drama Exclusive cuts, not shown on TV, and backstage interviews and lots more. Just text PF to 303 from an MTN line to subscribe for 7 days at 100 Naira only. And access all the content you like for one week on www.projectfamewestafrica.com. Don't miss anything. Get it all live on your phone or tablet anywhere, anytime. What a feeling! MTN, everywhere you go. What's up, what's up, me, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Faust, AKA Faust, the bad guy. And generally speaking, they're also calling me the what's up guy. Ladies and gentlemen, I rep Project Fame. 
I read Prozephim because Prozephim is that manner of a scenario whereby it is a celebration of talent. Understand? Now, this is that manner of stuff that whether you are somebody in life, you are having a talent in your body, you can be able to project to the world at night. I love it so much because of this. Because this just go to show that at least once you are having the talent and you can put in hard work in and anything else, from there you can be something else in life. This is why I strongly rep Project Fame. Do you rep Project Fame? Tell me why you rep Project Fame. Thank you so much. My name is Faz, aka Faz Bad Guy. Kisses. Hello guys, it's your girl Mirabel. I'm here again on probation. I need you guys, I need your help, I need I need your encouragement, I need your votes. Please, I really want to stay here and I I will keep fighting, I will keep pushing my best. My number is 10 as always. 10. Please, to 10 to 306 if you're in Nigeria, 10 to 1745 if you're in Ghana. Please, I really need you guys. God bless you all. Hello, West Africa. It's your boy, Perry Davis, again. I just want to say thank you for all those that voted for me last week and made sure I wasn't part of the bottom five. But as you can see, I'm still on probation again. And I want to appeal to you all. I beg, please, please, please try vote for me. Send my number 13. 13 to 306 if you are in Nigeria and 13 to 1745 if you are in Ghana. God bless you as you vote for me. God will keep blessing you. I love you all. What up, West Africa, it's your boy Yusuf. I'm on probation again. Ah. But all the same, thanks for the love you've been showing from the start. Anything, I really appreciate it. You've been the one that has kept me. And I know you won't be supporting me if you never saw something good. I beg. I continue. Latin my show love here. Check it. I really appreciate the love. And my number is 18. 18. And send the number to 306 if you're in Nigeria and 1745 in Ghana. I'm on our street. Hello, West Africa. It's your girl, Oluchi. And um, sadly, I'm back again. Please, I need you guys to vote for me. I need you guys to support me. I need you people to test my number, my wonderful number. It's easy to remember. It's just 12. 12, 12, 12. Please text 12 to 306 to vote for me. Text 12 to 1745 if you are in Ghana to vote for me. Please, just 12. Hmm? It's easy to remember, Abby. Jesus had 12 disciples, so you will remember. Please remember 12 and vote for me. Hmm. Hello, West Africa. It's your girl, Wina, again. Right now, I'm on probation and I need your votes badly. You can text 17 to 306 if you're in Nigeria. If you're in Ghana, one seven four five empty lines only. I depend on you guys. Thanks. Mwah. What up, what up, people? West Africa, it's your favorite boy, Dako. I'm on probation, which is not a good feeling, and it's definitely not a good thing. I want you all, beautiful girls out there, the real homies, the real guys out there, the people of the streets. I love you all. I want you guys to get me out of probation. My number is three. Text number three to three zero six if you're in Nigeria, and the same number three to one seven four five if you're in Ghana. Love you all. Watch exclusive Project Fame content on www.projectfamewestafrica.com. Send PF to 303 to get the Project Fame super subscription and you can watch much more for much less. Only 100 Naira for seven days.